to the show. When you think of Halloween, ghosts might come to mind, but what about true crime? Spooky! Caitlin O'Connor is here today from Lexington's Blue Stallion Brewing to test our knowledge of true crimes and tell you about a great event where you can test your knowledge of it as well. Caitlin, great to have you with us today. Hi, thank you so much for hosting Good me. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yeah. So I've got some spooky questions to ask you to kind of kick off our true crime trivia okay. tomorrow. Are okay. you ready for this? So, but We're wait ready. Before we do the questions, we come We're to the place. Ready. Do we sign up uh, how do we oh, get yeah so it starts tomorrow night on Halloween at uh -huh. seven o'clock just show up and grab your information from local trivia action they do all of the themed trivias around town uh -huh. as well as the kind of weekly shows okay. that different breweries and bars and restaurants host all right nice. so just come on up anytime I suggest getting there early to get a seat mm -hmm. but it starts at seven and it's gonna be a great time all right, all right. Ask, so ask, much ask fun. A question okay you ready okay Stephen Avery was convicted for the murder of this Wisconsin woman. Ready? A, Rebecca oh. Knowles. B, Sandra Murray. C, Laura Ricciardi. Or D, Teresa Halbrick. And you seem really pumped, Kaylee. D, that? Teresa Halbrick. You got it. Yeah. I was hardly. a big Making a Murderer fan. Yeah, I was going to say, anybody okay. who's into true crime has seen this. Yes, I'm sorry. I didn't mean Chris to buzz in. Chris Goodman interviewed him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Chris Goodman from our station. He oh, really? Stephen every years really? ago. Yeah. That's cool. Yes. All right. We saw a picture of them together. I guess it was an interview. <laughs> okay, so next one. <laughs> Which serial killer enjoyed dressing up as a clown for charity events? Ew. And this one I pretty much already know, but okay. Really? Dressed up as a clown yeah, for charity right? events? Weird, weird. Like, spent a lot of time around kids. Is this whatever. multiple choice, too? Yes. Okay, okay. fire okay. away. Ian Brady, Dennis Rader, or John Wayne Gacy. Oh, John Wayne Gacy. Yes, okay. So your your guys are one for one. I guess he's more your era. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> okay. Okay. Up next, this person is the most prolific serial killer known in US history. Harry and this Harman. one's multiple choice too. Oh. What'd you say? Nothing. Okay. Gary Ridgway, Jeffrey Dahmer, or Paul Knowles. I want to mm. say Jeffrey Dahmer because I I've only, not. but he's not serial killer. What? Well, no, he is. I don't know. I'm confused. He's not a serial killer. I mean, he is, but I don't. But think I, he has I, to I be just the don't most. think you you because he was obviously the most famous person in that list. So I think this is a trick question. To I'm going to say go for ooh, C. Paul Knowles. Ooh, I'm I'm disagreeing with you. It's Gary Ridgway, Green Gary. River Killer. Oh, of oh. course. He killed like 48 women, but they think it might be as much as 70. Wow. Oh my Guys gosh. Are so Weird. this is just a night of laughs over to Blue Stallion. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be you a great time. You come and well, you just... Yeah. <laughs> it's perfect for Halloween. Yes. Lexington's okay. Blue Stallion Brewing Company is hosting True Crime Serial Serial Killers Trivia tomorrow night, Halloween night from 7 until 10. They're located at 610 West 3rd Street in Lexington. Go to their Facebook page for more details and don't forget to try out all of their awesome brews. Yeah. Very good. Thank you Thank for you playing so with much. us today. Thank you. Thanks, Enjoy your Buick. Cheers. <laughs> Stay with us. Pet of the Day is next.